hello and welcome guys in a new video in today's video we will going to build react js dashboard this is the dashboard that we will going to build in this dashboard we will going to use chart.js for creating these charts like horizontal chart vertical bar chart and many more and we going to use material ui grid for making this table in this table we can select or edit according to our what we want to edit and we can easily filter and sort them by their name in ascending or descending order and also we will going to use pagination for this grid and also going to see how the tractor dome works it is a fully responsive app We need to first create React app. For this, go to terminal and new terminal, and then type npx create as React as app space dot s. Takes some time. So let's skip this process. And now it's done. Let's delete some files that we don't need. Setup test.js, report web, vitals.js, logo.svg, app.test.js, and index.css also we don't need. And go to index.js, remove that, and in some imports. Now go to public folder and then go to index.html file, change the title, React tab to React dashboard. And then go to app.css remove all the css and then go to app.js now let's start the server by typing npm start in terminal press enter it takes a little bit time so our server is running properly now let's go to the now let's go to the google fonts In Google Fonts, search for DM Sans font and then select regular 400 style and then click on import. Copy this import link and paste it in app.css. And 
of the font family let's do this data folder is to file one is image dot avatar dot png for avatar and then second is dummy.js in this dummy.js there is a data which we are going to use you can find passport. this dummy.js file in the description below now create components files Charts.js Charts.css Let's fast in this process And now we have to do one more thing. Yeah, right. RAFC import. We have to do this in all JS files. inside it sidebar and blow this get another div named as map so inside this map div create a r div name as map bar Right, map bar div put map bar component and 
also import these components Second is of eighteen percent, eighty percent. We need a gap between them of them. Not side bar. Give side bar. Our chart is index of one. Then top nail. This nail. Marching of 1.15 RAM and we need media queries to make it responsive. These are the media queries for app.js file. Media screen in which max width is 1024 pixels. And it's for small devices. My expert is 600 pixels. Let's go to right bar. Inside bar, create a name, name container. Add container to create another name logo. Logo for dashboard. Inside logo, we This is a right dashboard. Now go for it. menu div. Inside menu div, create div name item. Add item. Let's see what we 
must import these icons. CSS dot container give it height hundred percent width seventeen percent position fixed give padding give padding zero point two ram to top and bottom and one ram to left and right with background color and in six seven e seven
border radius pipeline and then transistor zero point two seconds or smooth dot icon if this icon is font size 1.4 ram and margin right 1 ram and margin right 1 ram and then item over background color going to change in this and color to change in this also we need cursor as a pointer when we hover on item so, for media queries that.css now go back to slide model css logo icon display yeah. and the small devices load container give it a bit of seven percent in small devices give it eight point five for its no devices margin left minus one and then border radius zero last one for sidebar dot senses icon for dot logo logo icon font size 2.5 Let's have a sidebar. We need to forget give display grid in my view. It's not working yet. Not really working. Display in line. Justify cell. Send. We need to change the template column. Inside H3 tags, item dot and right. 
October menus. This route a path. That this is the path for component home element.
also change in app.css file in dot main in dot main the template columns We need to have make one of the right now so let's do some css work dot net bar give it a height of 3 then with 100 percent display flags justify content that Justify content. Flags and 
line item center background color
justify content enter span inside user data padding right 8 pixel font size font size 1.15 Percent. Is it responsive or not? Why these icons aren't small?
easier to find spot charts. Let's create layout for charges change. Yes, Just 
Also install in PMI chart.js. Sets. 
for the love of your skin. And get up. Plus. title
data for example we paste it in vertical bar chart just random data Vertical bar chart is also ready. Now go for line chart. This is the data for the chart.
online chart is also right you can create area chart and donut and also donut chart this is the donut chart and this and this is the area chart now go for more component now we are going to make this home page and this we will going to use this donut chart here First, we need to install our dependency. Like this. Yeah, circular progress path. First, import. Then need to import some symbols or icons. Also import circular progress this bar. We are going to use donut chart. Inside this table, create a table name and container. Inside this table, create a div in box. Add this box, create another div name box icon. Inside box icon. Load box icon div create our div name box that is 
pen it is this and plus 28 percent copy this box div Give this tip some style. It. Two fifty. Two fifty. Give this circular bar a value which is sixty six. Circle ratio which is zero point seventy five. And max value hundred. And text seventy five percent. Now we need to style this circular bar. First trail. Transform to take minus one thirty five degree to take minus thirty five degree. Transform origin center center stroke width For path transform same transform origin is same stroke. The stroke color is and the stroke width is four point five.
return to the donut chart, give it a name card inside this place donut com inside this place donut chart component Now go to home.css Home container Display flag Justify content Space even Flex wrap. It wraps the boxes automatically when we shrink when it either decrease the width of the screen size. Or box. Give the height of 10 RAM to box and width of 15 RAM. Margin 1 RAM. Box icon position absolute with five RAM with five RAM margin top two RAM margin left one RAM what are the ideas with We need a uh, repact on box when we have over box so icon is icon size is increased Then box data and box size. Bring them display flags. Justify content center. Align items center. And give a box shadow. And for box shadow. state here now box data give it flex direction column height 8 ram width 100% margin top 5 ram background color and border radius of 10 pixels box data span inside box data give it a color of
zero four two four four. H one inside box data. Data. Font size of two M. And color. Then select. child one give it a background color zero container to give it a display flags and cap of unran for card give height 26 ram width 50 percent margin top 4 ram Display flags, justify content center, line item center. Background color, text color. Border radius of 10 pixels. Also, we need box shadow. Good media. <coughs> Full media queries. Dot home container to display facts, justify content, send. For card in medium devices, that will it to eighty percent. For small devices, that box width to twelve lakh. This is some mistake that we are doing.
change align content to align items. We need to select the box icon for color them. these boxes Thank <laughs> you. 